Well, syphilis is sexually transmitted. That's, that's the only source or way. You can acquire syphilis through intercourse, anal sex, or oral sex. And it's a skin-to-skin -skin contact. That's how the, the transmission of the infection occurs. And basically, you have a, a lesion on the genitalia, a penile lesion, or a lesion on the, the vaginal area. And the duration will be one to five weeks. In about six weeks, to 10 weeks, you will transition into a secondary rash. And that may be on the hands, the feet, palm or planter, or you may see the rash on the torso or the face. Those are some of the secondary characteristics of the infection. And that'll last about two to six weeks. And then the latter stage of the infection, you worry about syphilis in the tertiary stage because you get mental issues. Dementia may occur um, when people get neurosyphilis. Also, there's large knots that may have formed in the joints known as gumas. The worst case scenario is syphilis sometimes may innervate into the aorta which can be traumatic. So that's one reason we're always concerned about syphilis infection rates and making sure that everyone in the community is safe.